Hey everybody, I have had several requests to do a video on how to network the ADAT HD24. Uh, this is a hard disk recorder and the idea is that after we've recorded music on it, how do we get files off this thing? Well, here's the idea. On the back of this device is a jack for Cat5 Ethernet, so you can connect it to a switch or a hub or a router or a modem or any device that you have uh, in your home network. And that's what I've done here. I've got this connected into my home network with a bunch of my computers. So all we have to do on this device is we press the utility button right here. We press it till we get to utility five right here. And then we say yes. So now we're ready to transfer files off this device. It's gonna be transferred off this hard drive. If you had a second hard drive in here, it would show up also. So we go over to uh, my computer and uh, yes, do not adjust your television sets. This is 2024 and I'm still using Windows XP on this computer. It's frozen in time from 2005. So I'm gonna double click this icon here. All this does is it runs this command. Explorer FTP and then the IP address of the HD24 on the home network. It has a static IP address. So I'm going to double click this. Okay. And uh, you get this window that comes up and you have to log in. So you right click, log in as, and then you have a username and password that you've programmed into the uh, HD24. And bam, it appears on your network. And it only has one hard drive in it right now. So we click on that hard drive and each of the tracks that we've recorded appears as a folder in the root directory. So the uh, song I just recorded was this one, track number 11, and we can download the files as uh, AIFFs or as WAVs. And so I normally uh, copy them as WAVs. So what you could do here is you could grab a bunch of them and it's just drag and drop into wherever you want to place them. And uh, there you go. Now it is not super fast because the connection speed is only 10 megabits per second instead of the standard gigabit ethernet that we have uh, usually uh, these days. And actually this is double. It usually takes about seven minutes instead of 14. But um, that's as easy as it is to transfer WAV files out of this device. So the idea is that in your limited space home studio, if you wanted to, you could record 24 tracks simultaneously on this device and then transfer the WAV files out directly into Pro Tools or Cubase or whatever you use. And there you go. I hope you found this interesting. Thanks very much for watching. You guys are awesome and I will see you on the next video. Take care.